I am so ready for a glow up, but I am so, actually so nervous. my hair before and we're talking maybe two and a half nearly three years ago now this is my hair now obviously blonde um i've been dying it blonde now for two and a half three years ago but i'm gonna go back brown ah! will i regret it i don't know i hope not i'm actually so worried i'm gonna hate it hence why i've done my makeup and i've got tan on because i'm so nervous to get it done look in the mirror look at myself and be like oh that was a mistake, you know? But no, I do feel ready. I just, I'm very, very nervous. But let's go, get my hair done. Ah! <laughs> Last lift pick. like I feel really good um it is a bit more it's not my actual natural color obviously they had to put they have to dye it so it's a bit more darker but I think my natural hair is a bit more ashier darkness will fade once I wash it because obviously it's bleached underneath you know what I mean but I like it I got my French back in um which I'm really happy with it's really like nice and so I can always have it like this kind of not like that, you know what I mean? Like a little bit, like a bit wispy. Got some layers, put in again. It's gonna take me a few days to get used to it, obviously. But I was so nervous. Bit blessed in the salon, they were so lovely. They were like, this is one of the biggest changes we've ever had. I was like, right. Or maybe that was just this year. When I filmed this, it is currently like 13th of January, I think. So not much to go on. So yeah, this is me. This is me. <laughs> I feel like a mum. I feel like I look like my mum, which is not a bad thing, but I just feel like I look, I'm giving, I think I'm, I feel like I'm giving mum. She's a brunette girl. Ah! I've actually only literally just got used to my hair because I've walked past somewhere and be like, oh, who is that? People have been really nice about it. So yeah, I am enjoying it still. It does need a wash, but we're going to do that tomorrow because I've got some blue shampoo. Hopefully get out some of the warm tones. The glow I've tied quite well in because I'm going to a wedding this week, another wedding. Like I have never been to so many weddings in my life. I'm just like, oh yeah, another wedding, another wedding, another wedding. To absolutely no surprise to any of you who've been around for a while, <laughs> the eyebrow waxing strip bag is out because again, she hasn't waxed her eyebrows off camera. But that's a trend. I never do my eyebrows if I'm not doing it on a video. So of course I've got to get it in here. This is the before. I'm actually really happy with how my eyebrows have grown compared to when I was younger. I mean, I did massively over pluck them. Like they were horrendous. I'm scared. <laughs> like look how much better they're already looking. Oof. Waxing just makes them so much clean, so clean. I've actually been waiting like weeks to fill, to be able to film this video. I've just, I've put it off, it's purely my fault. But I've been waiting ages because, I'm not sure if I put it in another video, but I got this for Christmas, this little quarterly detox mask and it like she pulls all the oil. So I'm kind of, breaking out again a little bit on my chin. But I felt like my skin was actually doing really, really well. And then 
I think it is just hormonal and to be fair I haven't been eating too too good in the last maybe like few days it's just kind of broken out a little bit but like they're like really painful like under the skin one so I'm hoping that this will work I like to also bring this like under here because I've got like some pores like under here definitely on my nose and I don't really bring it on my cheeks because I don't know I don't know why I do I actually can't move my mouth <laughs> this is how the mask is looking now you can see all the oil this might be a bit gross sorry but all the oil in my nose around here it hasn't really picked it up much here oh my gosh it's like sore but like good I think it like firms it as well Titan's pores <laughs> okay let's get this off you take it off, it does feel very fresh. I find that with all the cordly stuff. This is the SPF I use, the La Roche Posay one. I know loads and loads and loads of people use it, but does anyone else actually feel like it kind of stings their face? I've never had an SPF like, sometimes it doesn't, sometimes it doesn't. I don't know if I'm not using enough. I don't know. Like it kind of makes my face all tingly, but I don't know if that's good or bad. Just come back from the gym. So I had to take it off my tracker. If you watched the last video, you'll know. I do this every single time I do one of these, I come and take it off. Cause it's just that, that little bit of satisfaction. This is my progress. I feel like I'm actually doing really well, especially with this one. This is all good. Walk's done well. Yeah, so I'm very, very happy. Main thing for me was the don't stress and we're doing pretty damn good. That's like a little glow up, you know? A little a little mindset glow up. Oh, this hair though. You know what, it's, it's hair wash day. It's blue hair wash day. And I did put an oil in this morning again. I put in the hair syrup one. So my hair smells like a little guava. I'm not complaining. Tomorrow is the day that I go home for the wedding. I haven't packed, I need a tan, do nails, do toenails, do my hair. I bought this blue shampoo. So this is from Fanola. You get it, I get it on Amazon. I used their pale shampoo when I had blonde hair and it's the best thing ever. Like it's, it literally stains your hands. It's so strong, so you have to wear little gloves. Um, so yeah, I got the blue one because I feel like in some lights my hair does look kind of warm. Gonna go in with a trusty air wrap. First, gonna use some heat protection. I know some people are really not fans of the air wrap, but I do really like it. I mean, I would say if you want if you want curl curls, I have a curler as well. But for like a nice blowout, I mean, it doesn't really last, but I love it. It's less heat as well, so especially when I'm trying to repair my hair. When I was in the hairdresser a few times ago, she was like, "Your hair's thin. Like each hair thing is." Thin. The hair, your hair is thin, thin, your hair is thin. There's loads of the hairs, so it looks thicker, but it's actually thin, if that makes sense. <laughs> to do my little bangs, I use the, the curler attachment, not this one. I use this one. I find that's the best because, obviously you do get this one in, which I have used before, but I find it makes, because I've got the, I've got little bits of breakage and like the, the baby hairs, it makes them all like stand up. So I find if you've got bands and one air wrap, this, the big barrel will be your best friend. Like I'm for the wedding, I think I'm gonna take my air wrap just with this attachment so I can do my fringe. <laughs> and then of course you've got to look a little bit crazy. If you, if you don't look like this after, done something wrong. Let's use this brush. You know that gorgeous blow dry that I spent while doing this morning? It's gone. Long gone. This is me after work. <laughs> like there was no point. There was no point. Anyway, I thought for work tomorrow, I'll just put it like this, redo my fringe, and then for the wedding, I've got my actual curler. Speaking of which, your girl has packed. I've got all my toiletries, makeup brushes, makeup, heels, bag, Dyson air wrap, 
and my curler. Pajamas, my dress, very important. My wrap thing. And then some comfy clothes for the rest of the weekend. So yeah, I think I'm all packed. I have got my backpack as well with just like my stuff for work, which I need to finish off. I picked these up a while ago. Last 2023 me, I love the Primark nails. Still do love them, still very, very affordable. I've been now been trying these Kiss ones. Last set I got, they lasted for three weeks on my nails. They were really long compared to these ones. So I'm hoping these ones last, if not a bit longer. I mean, that would be sick. They are more expensive, but they're good. And the glue's good. This is the before. And these are the final nails. I think they are so nice, hey? I feel like they look so natural. Especially because the white bit isn't like white, white. I feel like really good. Not gonna lie. Just arrived. I'm watching the hotel room because this is the nicest hotel I've ever stayed at. So like, I'm already making myself a cup of tea. But this is this room. And then this is our view. And then this is the gorgeous bathroom with the double swimming. And then we have a dressing gown. I've always wanted to go to a hotel that has dressing gowns.